Hello, the Senior Health Team at Arch Edder & Company would like to share with you a simple presentation on the potential savings advantage with Medicare Supplement Plan G. Why Plan F or Plan G? Plan F is typically thought of as a Cadillac plan due to its comprehensive benefits. Plan G can be a smarter choice as it can provide significant cost savings over Plan F with potential lower rate increases. Here's a quick comparison of the differences between a Plan F and a Plan G. You'll see Plan F covers everything Medicare lists as a potential Medigap benefit, whereas Plan G does not cover the Part B deductible. Let's go into this a little bit further. What is the Part B deductible? After your first bill each year for Medicare Part B services, you are required to pay the one-time Part B deductible. Once the deductible is met, Medicare pays 80% of the eligible services and your Medicare supplement plan pays the remaining 20%. Part B eligible expenses include charges for physician services, hospital outpatient services and supplies, physical and speech therapy, and ambulance services. The yearly Part B deductible for 2018 is 183. Let's take a look at a couple example quotes for a 65 year old male for both Plan F and Plan G. You will see the annual premium for Plan F is 1605 and the Plan G annual premium is 1252. Let's see if there's a savings advantage with the Plan G over Plan F in this situation. We'll enter the Plan F annual premium, which is 1605. Next, we'll enter the Plan G annual premium, which is 1252. Finally, we'll enter the annual Part B deductible, which is 183. Knowing that the Medicare Supplement Plan G does not cover the Part B deductible, we'll need to add that in so that we can compare the two plans having the same features. So we'll take the Plan G premium, which is 1252, and add in the Part B deductible, which is 183, which brings us to a maximum annual Plan G cost of 1435. Now let's see if there's a potential savings advantage with the Plan G over the Plan F. First, we'll enter the annual Plan F premium of 1605. Then we'll take the Plan G premium with the Part B deductible at an end, which is 1435. Then we can subtract the two to find the cost savings of $170. So that's 170 annual savings for 2018 if the client spends 100% of the Part B deductible for any out-of-pocket expenses. Now, if the same person doesn't spend any of their Part B deductible that year, then we have the potential 2018 savings advantage of $353. We encourage you to show your clients both Plan F and Plan G, along with the potential savings advantage they can have between the two. Thank you for watching our brief presentation on the Plan G potential savings advantage. The senior health team at our and Company is ready to assist you with any questions or product information. Please give us a call 800-228-0008 or email us at seniorhealth at jetter.com and be sure to ask how you can receive a free Medicare supplement coding tool. Thanks for your business and have a great day.